What's going on YouTube? West Hobbies RC. So today we are back with the Goblin 380 KSC Edition. So huge shout out to Michael. Michael, I made a post on Facebook after we destroyed the 8S Monster 380 and it was the day before I was leaving for Archa. He said, hey, I got one. We made a deal. I purchased the model from him. Well, I traded him a helicopter for the 380 airframe and I was going to build it for the new Monster 380. But it's a KSC edition and I couldn't see myself tearing the KSC apart to make it a speed model. So I ended up picking up two more 380s at Urcha that were just the airframe, no head or nothing. And, and that is what we used to build the new Monster 380. So this 380, I talked to Brian and I said, hey, let's build a flyable 3D 380. So that's what this is here. So we are running, of course, nothing other than the X Nova 2820. X Nova motors are my favorite motor. We are running Theta servos, 921As on cyclic and 982 on tail, V-bar Evo and an old Pulse uh, 6S1800 milliamp. So I went through the whole helicopter and replaced the boom so it's all new, new stickers, uh, carbon tail blades are on it, put a new set of a line, 360s or 380s on the main, went through everything, got the new Hobby Wing a, uh, V5 120, or no, 80, yeah, the V5 80. It's super small, really tiny ESC, so that fits in there great. XT60 connectors, and I put the magnetic mounts that I had from my old 380 on it, because you guys know on the Speed 380, it also, the, the magnetic mounts made the canopy come loose. And I also put the old skids from the original Speed 380 on there. So now it has a little bit of the original 380 into its life, but I couldn't see tearing it apart to make it a speed machine. We are flying on a V-Bar Evo. So we are going to spool up and this is going to be the maiden flight. We are running plus or minus 13. See how it flies. Spool up. Very smooth. Bang three. It's feeling pretty good. Blades look to be tracking good. I do want to make an RPM adjustment. So let me do a tuning adjustment. So let me just do that real quick. That's what's great about V-Bar. Don't tip over. Ah. That's one thing about those skids is if you're not taking off of hard surfaces, they can tip over. All right, so we're going to go in real quick and we're going to raise our RPM 2100. Thank you. 2400 and we're gonna go to 3200 okay one. let's try that again but it fly it's flying good it feels smooth let it do all its little wibble wobbles all right that rpm is much better Nice cruising RPM. The gains feel good all the way around. Speed up cyclic a little bit. But it is solid. An X Nova 32 or 30, 2820 has good power for a little motor. Going to the high head speed, we see how it feels here. Feeling really good. A little slow on cyclic, but that's okay. It's 
been a long time since I've flown a 380 that wasn't for speed. Oh yeah, I forgot how good the 380s are. Tons of cyclic authority. And it's weird seeing a red 380 that's not my speed 380. I don't know when you guys are going to see this, but I think it'll be before, but we did build another one. And it's got even more power. New motor. bug on my shoulder. Let's see, what are we at percentage-wise? 30% left in the battery. Super solid. I mean, that right there, that's a hands-off hover. You can't ask for a more solid machine than that. Oh, and one thing I wanted to touch on in this video is not all of you guys, you guys are great. All right, but there's a few of you, especially that comment on Facebook, that'll make comments in the videos, that talk about how that because I am a BK sponsored pilot, that I get paid. I can assure you guys, I do not get paid for anything, okay? Nothing. Even on those little ready to fly helicopters, I'm, I don't even think I'm making more than like a 2% commission on every sale, and I probably sold one. All right, I'm not doing this for the money. Okay, I'm doing this because of the love of the hobby and for helping each and every one of you and all that you guys do. Your support. When I fly Mikado, it's because it's paid for out of my pocket. These machines are built. Yes, some of them are customer machines. They are. But radios, FBL, servos, it's all out of my pocket. I do not get paid to do this. Companies don't send me a V-Control or V-Bar Evos. They don't. You don't make any money even as a sponsored pilot. I do get a discount. Yes, I will get a small discount, but that is it. I don't get money. I'm not becoming rich off of this. So I just wanted to clear that up for you guys that think that because I'm a sponsored pilot that I am biased. I am not. I make the same videos I have made forever. All right, let's set this down. I just had to go on a little rant. Apologize for a little rant. But when I say, you know, the X Nova Motors, it's because I love X Nova Motors. I've been, you gotta remember guys, I've been doing this my entire life. Way before I started doing YouTube videos, I've been in the hobby. I've been using X Nova since I started flying helicopters and I could afford to buy my own electronics, okay? I don't just say X Nova is the best because they pay me to say that, no. I say it because that is my findings after all these years of me flying. I don't just say Theta servos are the best because Theta pays me. No, they are the quietest, most precise and powerful servo that I have found. I don't say that I V control is the best radio and everything else sucks because V control pays me. No, I don't do that either. V control doesn't pay me. They don't send me transmitters. They don't send me anything, nothing. I don't get a dollar from them. Okay. Hobby wing. I don't get a dollar from them. What I say is my personal opinion. If you guys want to take it as advice, take it. If not, that's fine. But just so you guys know, I am not biased. I don't do this because I want to sell stuff. I make zero dollars off of it, okay? Zero. At that being said, sorry for the rant. Little 380, flying amazing. Awesome little machine. The three blade KSE head is great. It looks good in the air, flies precise. Very happy little helicopter. So there you guys go. Made in flight on the Goblin. 380 KSC edition. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you haven't already, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, comment down below, leave a comment. Take care and have a great day.